Since I originally videotaped my story in 2015, I've had many women approach me to thank me for sharing my story. Some of them told me that after watching my video, they scheduled a mammogram. If you are overdue for a mammogram, please don't wait any longer. This is the reason why I am sharing my story. Thanksgiving Day of 2008, um, I put the turkey in the oven and I had uh, great-grandmother's china out. We were having the family over and I went to take a quick shower and I lathered up and I went to reach for under my arm and I felt a lump in my breast. I had just turned 40. I had no family history of breast cancer at all and I wasn't really late for mammogram, but this just totally blindsided me. It just knocks the breath right out of you. Your whole entire world just turns right upside down. And with the holidays coming, Thanksgiving, Christmas, New Year's, it would have been easy just to kind of deal with it later. But I kind of felt a sense of urgency with it, so I made an appointment with my primary care physician, which is Dr. Lewis. He got me in right away. I had a mammogram and a sonogram, and I went to Dr. Kalinowski for a uh, biopsy. And within a week, I had a positive pathology test. I got that phone call that said I, I had breast cancer. Bronson was very professional and knowledgeable, and they got me through right away. Everything happened so smoothly, it just flowed. I had um, 20 weeks of chemotherapy, and I did eight weeks of radiation. And then because my um, cancer was hormone positive, I had to have a hysterectomy. Right after that, I ended up losing my husband. And then I was still going back for six months mammograms and they found a suspicious spot of cells on the other side. And that's when I made the decision that I wanted to get a double mastectomy because I was a single parent at that time and I wanted to make sure that I wasn't gonna come back. So I talked to Dr. Kalinowski and she was in complete agreement with me that this is really a good path to take. And I ended up getting a double mastectomy and I am now going to be six years cancer free. I'm just really grateful for technology and now we have diagnostic mammograms and we know so much more about breast cancer. So your chances are getting better and better at fighting breast cancer and winning at it versus probably 20 years ago, I probably wouldn't be here. But um, things have progressed and we have research and development, we have new drugs and it's just amazing some of the, the steps that they've taken to help fight breast cancer.